good. Try to make sure there's no bugs on it. Ooh, there's a lot today. There's a lot today. But Dad, you can't step in here, only us. I can step in here because I know where to step. You're the smallest? Hold it up to this one. Got it? On this bed. This Look at that harvest. That's a pretty good size harvest today. Yep. <laughs> I want to eat more. You want to bring this inside and put it on the yeah. kitchen counter? All right, let's get some beans. Let's start the video. <laughs> I think we might be just a little bit behind on our beans. Well, that's not too bad for the second harvest. My first harvest was like that, that bucket size. Now, this is my second harvest. Almost a five gallon bucket. That's enough for canning, so. And there's still tons of beans and flowers developing, so I'll get another harvest out of that. Kind of made a mess of the bushes, but it'll be all right. They'll recover. Now it's time for the yellow ones. And let me tell you, that's, I'm still a little, little bit disappointed about my whole, uh, the Cherokee wax beans, they're, they haven't grown anymore. That, that, that's it, they've grown maybe two feet at the tallest, two and a half feet, not the six to eight feet that they said, and all this trellis work is not doing anything. Oh well, still getting tons of beans. All right, let, let's, let's get to harvesting. Oh, what's happening to that green bean? I don't know. Well, I only got like maybe a quarter bucket of yellow beans. So they definitely didn't produce as much as the green beans. But uh, as you can tell, I still got tons developing and there's still more flowers. So yeah, uh, but I think that's still a very good harvest for a day. That's enough to do some canning. Definitely get a couple jars. Out of the green beans, oh! And uh, some of you might have noticed if you guys have or experienced 
Gardeners uh, have gone, I've let them go just a little bit too long. I would say uh, maybe a week too long on the vine. I should have harvested them just a little bit sooner. But it's all right, it's, I'm still pretty sure they're gonna be taste good, especially the way I cook green beans with bacon. So yeah, it's gonna, I think it's gonna be just fine. She's feeding blackberries to our dog. What the heck happened here? Oh, almost lost this tomato plant. Oh, I must have forgotten to wrap it around. I think this is one of my suckers, yeah. And look, apparently I had wrapped it all the way around to here and then it grew two feet in the last week and it's, it's, it's snapped over. Luckily it's still alive, but it's just straightened itself out here soon. But look at how tall, they're almost there to the top, they're almost there. From my last video where I said they're almost to the top, yeah, oh. Look at that, That's I need to sucker that one. The onion fell down. The onion fell down? <laughs> yeah, look, they're about six inches from the top now. This is amazing how tall it is. Yeah, these two are just jamming. Uh, I can't reach that. Uh, maybe I could reach it with my snippers. Right. Yeah, you can pick up that onion. We're probably going to harvest those onions today, too. Alright, well, that's another sucker. I'll just put it in that thing of water and let it root and I'll stick it in there somewhere. This one's almost there. Yeah, little onion. Put it in the buckets. But they are starting to turn red. I've already harvested a bunch of them. If you could see all the missing ones, it's not because they fell off. Was I've, I've been making a cucumber tomato salads for my wife. She loves it. And But my tomatoes are just about to turn red. I can't wait. Yeah, I just... All right. Thank you, baby. I love these Juliets, how, how they look. It looks fantastic. I love it. Oh, I forget, what are these? These are pink girls. And they're just jamming. Still growing. These are good. I think this is probably a pink girl sucker that I planted in the ground. It's growing, it's too. So yeah, they're starting to get tall. They're they're about six feet. As tall as I am. Let's go over to my cucumbers and get cucumbers off. Uh, oh, so um, I think I was a little pre premature with the baking powder spray. Uh, baking soda? Baking soda, yeah. The baking soda spray, uh, it has uh, kind of, it's kind of worked. Maybe, uh, I mean, there's still a little bit of the white stuff there, but I think it's, uh, it, it isn't spreading as much anymore. So I think it, it kind of works. Let's take a bite. It's so small. Take a bite. Well, not that part, the peas, actually. Yeah. What do you think? Good. Oh, I'm getting my banana peppers. Ah, uh, got... trick me. What, what? Actually, I thought it was like a giant pea. Is not? Yes, not. It's a tiny little one. Oh, there's two of them. That's a good sized little pea. Got my first banana pepper. I'm excited about that because I love banana peppers. Got my basket. Oh, it's already full of cucumbers. Looks like my kids already got some. Let's see if they missed any. Huh? Let's see if they left any for the to make a video out of. Uh, let's see. Oh, they missed one. That's for sure. Oh, they might have left me just one cucumber, huh? You guys just left me one cucumber? Dada. To harvest? Dada. There's, uh, little. there's still tons of tiny little ones like this big. I'm just waiting for them to about be like that. You know, four, maybe five inches. Dada. 
Come over here, Dada. There's this one like, over this here. This is like the size I'm looking for. You know? That's getting a little too big on the bigger sides. I don't like that. It starts tasting woody. Dada, I got one for you over here. What? Where? Right here. Oh, that's just, that's just still a little too small. Let's this? wait till tomorrow on that one, okay? Dada, baby dude. Acorns. Those are acorns. They are twit me because these are not poop. They're not poop. <laughs> Show them what you're talking about. What you what you find, baby? Yeah, they're not poop. Those aren't poop. Those are acorns. Your brother is being a brother. Since the kids already harvest the cucumbers, so much for a harvest. <laughs> Cucumber footage. <laughs> Oh well, I still haven't got a single lemon cucumber yet. And those, those are my favorite. Lemon cucumbers are my absolute favorite. I think I'm just gonna grab the rest of the onions. They're not doing any better. So, what did I learn about onions this year? When I plant them next year, I'm gonna hit them with more fertilizer and don't bury too deep. Oh, that's the biggest one. That's the biggest onion. <laughs> that's the smallest onion. No, I can do it, Dada. Alrighty then. Alright, well, uh, I think that'll be it for the video today. I've got a nice bucket of uh, green beans and I'm a little surprised with the yellow beans, the, the, the Cherokee yellow beans that didn't produce very well. But uh, like I said, you, like you saw, there's still tons. Um, on the vine so I'll get another harvest out of it and there's a lot more beans coming green beans coming also got some onions got some peas uh, sugar peas uh, those are just for snacking on throughout the day they won't last the day yeah so I'm gonna put my onions on the rack and it's pretty, it has a pretty good day though okay my name is Sang this is Growing Little Country Homestead I'll see you on the next one Alright, I'll see you on the next one. Thank you for watching.